Dean, league season's finally here. Yep. Happy about that. Um, I did not like the stop start. The pre season uh, was decided late on. Uh, did uh, that affect us quite a bit in terms of our planning? But I thought overall the 1895 Cup, the Challenge Cup, travelling away to Barrow put us in good stead for today. Uh, and that proved it. We picked up two points. Scrappy game, uh, lots of penalties, lots of rook infringements. Um, at times we overplayed and tried to score on every play. Uh, and that's something that we've spoke about and we can all look after ourselves and, and make sure that we learn from today. We've got two points, we'll put that to bed and we'll move on to next week. The, the game started off where it was a, a bit of tight affair and you know trading sets um, and then Newcastle managed to get the noses in front. Obviously, you, you've just tried to concentrate on, on us this week, um, but did that change what, what messages you were sending out that because you've gone behind so well or <coughs> early yeah, on? Yeah, we, um, we didn't finish how we wanted to finish, so in terms of being putting them in a corner, uh, really starting to, to put some pressure on them. We, we allowed their, the pressure off, so the gas released too easy, whether that'll be from a six again on a five and last one, we've trapped them in their 40. Or the fact that they've gone and gone and kicked a 40-20 and we've we've not dealt with that and that's the pendulum at the back and to be honest that's some of our, our more experienced players that have got to get that right and they're, they're there for a reason. Um, difficult one to prepare for this week, there's, there's no way you can do a video and, and sometimes with the amount of dual reg and, and loan signings that, that teams in League One get in week by week it, it's difficult to do that but um, obviously going into next week Rochdale's a bit different but, but back on today the, the messages were still the same, it was all about us try not to overplay, finish how we want and there was a spell or a couple of spells where we really were what what we want to be and how we want to identify and that's defensively and with the ball and we scored some nice tries. Um, finishing out wide, we, we, we isolated three man and four man and we, we played some good stuff. Uh, we just need to make sure that we're, we're more consistent for 80 minutes and not take our foot off the gas or not think that we, we need to offload or, or have that Harlem Globetrotter style of, of football. Yeah. Now, that first half was, again, the full first half was a bit cagey, really. Uh, and, and as you say, a bit scrappy and maybe not where we wanted to be come half time. Yeah, let's be honest, it was garbage. <laughs> uh, it wasn't it were great. It wasn't great to watch. It wasn't great to be involved in. Um, we turned the screw a little bit in the second half. Um, and we, we were on the, the right side of a good penalty count. And, and I know they're probably complaining about it. But if you're honest, we're poking our noses through the line. We're standing up to play the ball. It's, it's a correct decision. We've all been told that and they can moan as, as much as they want really, but the decisions were, were right because we were on the front foot uh, and he's called it as he saw it. And we um, we played to what the, the new rules are and, and, and got the benefit of it today. And we need to make sure we keep doing that week in, week out because against the top six, seven sides out there, mm -hmm. you, you, they'll, they'll put you to the sword if we're on the, the wrong end of the penalty count. Yeah. Timing looked a little bit off in that first, or throughout the game really. Is, is that a consequence of having that gap from the Batley game? Yeah, massively so. Uh, it's a consequence of not having bodies in training. We're, we're lucky we've got people back now and I'm really happy about that because that, that gave us a lift towards the back end of the week. Um, it's also not playing week in, week out and the only way that we'll get better and the way I want us to play is to play week in, week out against opposition that, that put defences in front of us um, and, and structured defences that, that don't don't defend against us in training week in, week out, and, and that'll be important. Yeah. So, first win on the board, it's always nice to get that, that first win on the board. Um, takes a little bit of pressure away uh, just to get that first win yeah. of a new season. Looking forward to next week, and then we've got a short turnaround with it being Easter as well, so we'll play Sunday, Friday. Sunday, Friday, yeah. We've, we've already spoke about that as a, as a performance team, and we've worked with the SNC. Uh, we're really fortunate that we've got um, a deal with with Liz Beckett and their physio department that they're providing sports masseurs to come in and, and look after the boys on a Monday to make sure we get right and especially with the short turnarounds, the back the back to back weekends of going Rochdale away, Keithley home, Oldham at home, uh, that's a that's a tough run of fixtures and then to go to Midlands away as well. So it's a, it's all on now. There's 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 no taking our foot off the gas. We have to get better than this week. We've got to get better the week after and, and continue to do so until we get into the playoffs. And that's when we've got to make sure we're really hitting our straps and we're finding our form. Yeah. Well, congratulations on, on the first win today. Um, let's hope it's first of many. Thank you. Cheers.